I'm Lucas Crowell. I'm a pediatric surgeon who focuses on um, surgical oncology. And I'm very interested in uh, new technologies and especially 3D printing. And we do have experience with uh, 3D printing of complex surgical cases. I'm Philippe Fenollosa. I come, I'm the general manager of Fundació SIM from the Polytechnic University of Catalonia. And we are the technological center that is uh, collaborating with Hospital San Juan de Deu, where Lucas comes from. Well, um, those technologies are amazing. And um, having um, all these uh, technologies available will help the surgeon to do a better planification, a better planning for the surgery, and obviously a better outcome for the patients. Uh, the fact that uh, we are uh, we, we work for the industry normal automotive from a lot of years, and we have seen soon we've seen that with healthcare there was a lot of uh, work to do, but the fact was that medical world and engineering world were two, two upper, upper, upper worlds that didn't collaborate uh, and well, uh, part of the effort has been more about interacting, about talking, about seeing what do you need, what you can do, than a technological effort. But from talking uh, medical uh, doctors and engineers, we have seen that there are um, technology to be developed. So we are now just in the point that we see that we can really uh, push technology uh, on uh, by, by new developments. He pointed something very interesting. Like years ago, hospitals were in one place and then technolo technological centers in another place. And the future is working together, like we're doing now, like here, right? We have, um, the fact that is, we have seen how, how industrial solutions are closed solutions. Uh, well, they, have, uh, they make a lot of investments in new equipments, but uh, generally our equipment, uh, closed equipment that, well, you, you can't uh, test all the things that you would uh, like. So with open source technology, we are making experience because Dr. Lucas wants flexible vessels. And we are trying to give him flexible vessels because we are free to develop, develop new technology. So that's what we are doing. Well, this, this, uh, this trade, this fair is a first step. And well, we, we need to walk more steps in order to, to fix this fair into the international fair circuit.